All right, there, uh, there it is, uh, the first match. I request uh, Safai Stallions to please set up the field. Guys, come on. Salman, chalo. Let's set up the field and uh, let's get on with the match. As you can see, both the openers, uh, of course, uh, Keur Gelani and uh, Saurabh will be opening for their side. Umpires, please take the charge and uh, let's quickly start the match. Let the first ball be rolled out and uh, be pitched on the ground. On the crease, of course. Dot seven, we are going to start. So the tick tock is uh, started. The clock tick tock, tick tock, tick tock. Four minutes remaining. It's six fifty six now. Meanwhile, guys, uh, let's set up the field. We dot going to start at seven. Four minutes remaining. It's an eight over game per innings. Two power plays. <coughs> First over becomes very crucial uh, because uh, if any batsman gets out, then it's a uh, minus five. And in the fourth over, which is the monster over, every run will be doubled and every wicket will be considered minus five. More three minutes to go. It's six fifty-seven, and we are going to start at sharp seven o'clock.
All right, there. Uh, so I now request uh, the teams to get on with the play. As you can see, some final moments of planning uh, strategies uh, being going on with the uh, Safai Stallions. As you can see, Kewur is all set. He's got one half century to his name uh, today. What is he going to do? How is he going to approach the game? Because as far as I've seen Kewur uh, right from the commentary box, he's been always... to score in this 8-0 format half century is not an easy task which is done in the past a good player respect him for that and a very good uh, sportsman spirit that is always shown whether it is a win whether it is a loss but always being very calm and cool on the other hand always supporting Saurabh who is a young lad uh, always having a smile on his face even if he gets out if he thinks that you know it's it's okay he always uh, keeps a smile on his face and that is what is more important to uh, bring that positive energy into the team and now the Pollard height Imran the Pollard height uh, Altaf is going to bowl the first over it's going to be an exhausting day of cricket uh, the matches are starting now Sagar Dalvi behind the stump Siddesh taking the square leg position we have Preet who is standing very close to uh, the crease. Then we have Salman taking the uh, mid-on position. We have Rizwan taking the mid-off position. Zaid, of course, the favorite place in which he used to love to field. It is long-on region. Shoaib is standing uh, just exactly at the mid-off uh, mid-on position. Salman moves uh, a little on the widest uh, mid-on position. Samir is of course taking the uh, covers region. So it's a nice looking uh, field setting by uh, Sagar Dalvi. Of course Abhishek uh, taking uh, the Gali region. So it's all set and it's all good to go. Let's hear a lot of applause for the first ball. Nicely tapped. Uh, Right away on the mark, a uh, bit of a misfield there, but that will not allow the batsman to take the second run. Just a quick single with that, uh, Kaur opens his account and of course the team's account as well for a single. Quick single there, uh, again bit of a field change, uh, Abhishek brought uh, closer to uh, the batsman here, the left and right hand combination. Working out very, 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 very well. Quick single there. That will be a wide ball on the onside, and this is exactly what happens when a right and bat left and batsman combination is there. Nicely flicked, uh, just a quick single. Azun, Azun, Azun. Quick single there on the on side. Pass. Brings back uh, Kheur on strike. <coughs> a nice late cut, but uh, equally nice stop by uh, Abhishek. Probably avoided the single there. It was a very good late cut, thoughtfully played. Again, uh, one bounce. Quick single there. That will be straight in the hands of Salman there. Uh, no run on that occasion. Even they are watchfully playing this first over. Padmanabh sir. Five balls have been bowled. One to go. Oh, this was a good, good, good chance and uh, was a very important catch to be hold off. Two things would have happened. One of the finest players, Kaur, would have got out and uh, minus five would have been also noted on the scoreboard. But the ball just popped out of his hand uh, at the last moment. Good save uh, though for uh, Keur.
he would be happy. Brings back Saurabh, the left-handed batsman, on the strike. After the first over, Altaf bowled a very good over, giving away just three runs. Quick single there. And uh, that will be uh, three runs of the first over. And uh, that will be again into the gap uh, for a single there. So singles at the moment for uh, Jupiter 11. And uh, they would be waiting for the right opportunity to uh, hit down one on the ground. That will take some time because uh, right now there is no risk of uh, having a minus five. But at the same time, you have to be very clear and sharp in uh, your approach. That would be a wide, uh, just trying to use the fingers to his maximum, using the strength of the shoulder to release the ball. Abhishek. Altav there uh, with a very good stop. Uh, well, I think he's been taking a lot of pra fielding practices in the nets and uh, a good stop there for uh, a dot ball to be delivered by uh, uh, Abhishek. in the air for some time. This time it's a good gap uh, going towards the declared zone. It's been a decent start by uh, Jupiter. What these both batsmen are doing is trying to be on the field, spend some time trying to uh, understand the situations out here because of course it's a new day. We're playing after a weekend. Yesterday we could have played but uh, the rains delayed uh, the play. And uh, that's the reason we didn't have a match yesterday. But this time again, uh, keeping it outside the off stump, Abhishek. As I told you, he's using the fingers and the wrist both equally to release the delivery using the strength of the shoulder. Look at that once again on the front foot. Just a quick single straight to uh, Nitin. He makes no mistake, gives the ball back to Abhishek. One to go in this over. And that's a no ball in the air for some time. That will land up in the uh, safe zone. Sort of wanted to go for a second one very desperately. End of the over. Not end of the over. Of course, uh, it's gone in the declared zone. Just a quick single. So that will allow Sort of now to take the license to hit anywhere. Boundary. Oh, sorry. That's a, that's a, that was a boundary. No ball and boundary. So five runs on that uh, ball. Trying to take the advantage uh, this time. He will be beaten by pace. So good uh, dot ball to end the over. Playing on an average of six runs per over. It is 12 for no loss. <clears throat> it's a good start there. Now Zaid will come to uh, bowl. And yes, uh, as Karuna Karkotian said, it's a power play over. Scorers, please make a note of it. It will be a power play. As Karuna Karskotian sir uh, tells us. So now this is going to be very important. What is going to be the bowling change and who's going to bowl? Because again, this comes just before the monster over. Where you talking about uh, the power play over, of course, there is only one fielder allowed on the uh, boundary. And this becomes very interesting because either you have to stand at the long on, long off, or the wideish long on, or the wideish long off. But then you have a very minimal scope if the batsman is hitting towards the deep, especially in that areas. You have to know where the field is set and accordingly you have to bowl the line and length. So this becomes very interesting there. And of course, batsman is always going to take charge on the power play overs considering there is uh, uh, no fielder in a certain position. So we'll love to try to hit uh, on that spot, try to get the maximum. But when you're talking about sixers, I think that's, that's the aerial route or uh, 
you know they want to go in the air and uh, hit a big one but when you're talking about carpet drives or when you're talking about a drive which you've made and it's gone one bounce or two bounce and uh, it might be in the air for some time but at the end it is how your placement is going to be how you're trying to find the gaps it is all dependent on that so let's see what keur has in his mind because uh, he's a wonderful player and we've seen him batting uh, in in the past and of course the one of the top batsmen uh, in the uh, mcs season 9 as well so now sagar being very cautious and very protective about the fielding as you can see he's taken abhishek uh, as a stopper power play has been cancelled so uh, no field restrictions there but anyways it's always a drama that happens in the power play over now rizwan you will see taking the long off zaid on the long on <coughs> Pre there, uh, straight to Siddesh. No run on that occasion. Bowlers are bowling economical at the moment. Again, a good stop. Uh, just one bound straight to Abhishek. Oh, this could have been a caught. dropped it again two drop catches so already two lies for uh, keur which for him is a very good thing and of course for jupiter 11 as well we saw some cracking batting last uh, week uh, by nikesh patani one man army that he is uh, in the air and uh, this will be straight to zaid the, the first wicket falling down for uh, jupiter 11 sort of trying to swing that one in the air and if you're not getting the elevation and the execution right you always going to find the man in the deep and when it's zaid he is one of the class fielders and this one was like a cherry on the cake for him very easy straight into his hands as if uh, it's the ball just got invited from him so the first wicket falling down of 13 runs in the third over so gaurav uh, comes to the crease gaurav gala another player who loves to go for singles doubles uh, try to wait for the wrong one try to hit a big one as well player of long innings and monish busy capturing those amazing pictures that you see it on social media in the air once again and straight to uh, shoaib and this time uh, gaurav will have to return back without troubling the scorers is out for a duck could have been a quick uh, cheeky single but uh, gaurav was too uh, late to react so the wicket number 2 falling down here for uh, jupiter 11 a dot ball ends the third over now it's time for the monster over the big over coming up every run will be doubled every wicket will be taken a minus 5 yeah and monish capturing some amazing images now there will be of course a team discussion of its a fire especially when the bowlers are bowling so 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 economically which is a need of the hour as i told you these are the league matches where uh, every team is going to just secure their two points on the point table and because uh, they want to secure this uh, because at the end they don't want to you know be there and fight for those uh, 
run rate uh, battle and that's the reason in this league matches the maximum you win you stay on the top of the table Siddesh comes to bowl this one uh, on the onside. Uh, Altaf will be fielding it. Quick single there on the onside. He will have again uh, Keyur Ghelani, who's got two lives in this uh, match. Shobit comes to the non strikers' end. As you saw, Gaurav uh, getting out. Well, this is a bit of a slow start for uh, Jupiter, especially when uh, Keur is uh, playing. Seems like a very, very, very slow start. That is nicely tapped, but uh, it was a double batted uh, shot, I would say. The ball hit the bat uh, twice. No run again. And they will uh, not take any kind of risk in this over because any wrong shot that you play, it will be a minus five. And that's what uh, Sapphire Stallions is looking for. Full toss ball in the air. And again, nicely fielded. Siddesh has been lucky to get away with that full toss ball. And today, a little different game that you've been seeing from Keur. He's trying to go for drives more uh, than hitting those big ones, which we're used to see it bit of a different play today. Look at that one. It's again, uh, Abhishek tried his best to stop that one. The bot was uh, carrying some height. Good back up there by Preet. And this is what we call presence of mind is very important in cricket. Got missed by Abhishek, but Preet was nicely backing it up. And this is the initiative that fielders need to take when it's a shorter format, when uh, you know there is no more uh, space for the batsman to hit the shot. So it's always going to be a close thing where uh, the batsman will either try to find a gap or just try to play those drives where uh, he can get those runs. But when you have these kind of initiatives, especially Preet right now, good presence of mind there. He was uh, to stop that one, uh, just missed by Abhishek. So it's all in the team. It's all always a teamwork. It's, it's just not a, 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 a job of a one person. Wherever you can find uh, that you can uh, help assist your players, it's always a good thing to do. Now Zed will come to the attack. Another fantastic player. Straight down the ground, uh, straight to Zed. Uh, in the air, and that will be an easy one for Sagar Dalvi. He doesn't miss many, and uh, I think it will be time for uh, Mr. Patani to come to the crease. Yes, he is. Nikesh Patani will come now. And uh, the need of the hour is big shots, big shots, and only big shots. 17 runs only on the scoreboard. Just the fifth over. Inside edge there and uh, could have been stopped nicely.
Full toss ball and this time it will be a good hit uh, and will be a boundary. So boundary after a long time for uh, Jupiter. Full toss ball played nicely by Shobit on the front foot towards the wideish uh, long off area. Very good comeback by Zayed. Very, very, very good comeback. In the air for some time, a catch was the call. But the ball will land safely. And end of the five overs, it will be 22 for the loss of three wickets. Just, just, just missed by Zayed. Uh, he almost got through the ball. Sagar, of course, is not happy because uh, Zayed has got height. Could have stopped it. One of the bad fieldings that I've seen from him. Nicely tapped. Uh, dot ball. And uh, that will be a big hit. The need of the hour is those sixes. Uh, nicely played by Shobit. Wonderful player that he is. Sharmaji has arrived here. And that will be in the air and uh, just falling short of Abhishek. Nikesh Patani back on strike. In the air and that is a class timing. Uh, Rizwan there with the catch. But of course, uh, it's all good in the center for the free hit. <coughs> 37 runs on the scoreboard. Nice carpet drive, but uh, only a single year. That will take the score to 38. That will be a wide ball. Well, that would be a wrong shot by Nikesh and a big wicket for... Uh, Sapphire Stallion, they would be very, very, very happy because he's the man who made all the difference in the last game. Of course, Nikesh is not happy with the shot, but he will have to still walk back uh, to the uh, dugout.
straight down the ground and finding uh, the man there, Shoaib. Uh, one more wicket falling down. It's all falling nine pins at this moment for uh, Jupiter 11. And that will be a very nice hit. So now Nitin will come to the attack to bowl the seventh over. Was trying to hit that one very hard uh, straight down the ground. Salman will stop that up. Quick single there. That will be again a no ball. Uh, slowly and steadily, uh, Jupiter are looking good on the scorecard. They've got 44 runs on the scoreboard. In the air again, uh, that will fall. Uh, no, it's a catch. Since it was a no ball, a free hit there. And that's a cracking shot. Wonderful strike, uh, straight down the ground. Ankit the batsman, looking for a big one always and uh, he delivers it perfectly. On the on side again, quick single there. And that's a clean bowled. Wonderful bowling.
well 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 uh, there it needed a direct hit unable to stop quick single that will be a big one but uh, not that uh, impressive because it will go all the way uh, above the fence that will be wicket number 7 what a try by sagar sanket sanket nahi sanket nahi sumit sumit is the new man in shahad on strike check the call is for two and uh, they will complete two last one delivery to go 58 runs on the scoreboard trying to hit that big one uh, but a single to end that 59 runs on the scoreboard and it will be 60 to win the game next up uh, we are going to have a toss between uh, ricky tigers and viking warriors wasim shake the and it will be uh, bobby marwa and uh, kazim it's all over to you all right toss time match number 2 day 5 ricky tigers taking on team viking warriors So I'm doing the toss. Who's calling? MCS. Ricky to call is MCS and Ibja. MCS. MCS is the call and Ibja it is. So Vikings have won the toss and elected to field first. Any special reason for that? No reason. No reason. They always ready to play. Bobby losing the toss. Does it make a difference? I hope not. <laughs> <laughs> so both are happy. News from the toss. Vikings wins the toss and elects to field first. Live action. Back to the page.
Well, and we just got a breaking news here. The competition is to watch. Yes, of course, it is Ricky Tigers and Viking Warriors, but more of it, it is Ankit and Asif coming in front of each other. And <laughs> this is something <laughs> that is going to be an interesting contest. Well, now the second innings is in progress. Uh, Kaur, the bowler, Abhishek, of course, on strike or non strike. There's Salman. GS with number seven jersey taking the uh, point region. That will be a white ball, uh, and that will open the account for uh, Stalins. Sapphire so Stalins. That is a good bowling. That is a very good bowling. Well, he's trying to do something different here, Keur. Is that a white ball, sir? White ball, white ball. White ball and one declare that will add up two runs to the total. That is uh, something that... Uh, is going to be very close uh, one did the bat hit the crease or did it hit the ball that did not impress the umpires so of course uh, it must have hit the crease That is a very good defense. On the onside, uh, Gaurav uh, late on the ball. Uh, Norande still want to go in this over, long over there by uh, Keur. Couple of extras. Well played there, uh, end of the first over, just giving away three runs in that over. So good start for uh, Jupiter 11 by Kiur.
good stop there uh, good start that will be a no ball well that is a very good carpet drive uh, straight to uh, sorab quick single on that occasion slow and steady wins the race things are pretty going slow for uh, safaya stallions at the moment and that is a big one uh, but straight to shobit a big fast throw by him quick single now things have started to move up for uh, stafair they taking single on every ball they charging down the ground uh, the intention is to get aggressive but that's going to be all wait and watch 60 runs to win white ball on that occasion well it doesn't matter how runs are coming at this point in time important is that the runs come for safaya the uh, bold very nice throughout good try to uh, go for a dive and completing the run by abhishek one to go in this over and uh, that will be a direct hit and the end of salman's innings uh, very good innings a good short roll that he has played out here 10 runs on the scoreboard more 50 to win Altaf is the new man in. That will be a clean ball and the end of Altaf's innings. Two wickets down now for uh, Safaya Stalin. and that is going to be sagar dalvi the new man in trying to play a reverse sweep completely missing that one
Again, trying to pull that one uh, this time on the onside, but will be a wide. Uh, that will be an edge. Just a quick single. Well, trying to charge on that one, and uh, that will be a no ball and a free hit coming up Abhishek's way. That is a good strike uh, straight down the ground. Just a quick single there. Again, on the onside, uh, trying to throw that one. Uh, but the throw is very wider. And uh, if you have to get those wickets early, you have to be very, 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 very clear on uh, your throws as well. Most of it direct hits makes things close uh, on a very close encounter. And that is something that you have to do. It's all about perfection, all about perfection. And an easy catch to uh, show with. End of uh, Abhishek's uh, innings. He's trying to go for the big one, uh, but uh, completely missing on it. Sagar Dalvi still on uh, the crease. Trying to make a change here, trying to make a statement here today when he knows that uh, his team is uh, bold, very economical. 60 runs is not a big task in eight overs, especially in thin format. And now it becomes very important because it is the monster over that is coming up. Bit of a change in bowling here as uh, Shobit comes to bowl the fourth over. The monster over, the very important over for both the teams. As you can see easily, this is the over of uh, surprises, this is the over of excitement, this is the over of enthusiasm. Because you don't know which way the game will go. Will it go with the batsman? Will it go with the bowler? Both have their uh, advantages and disadvantages in this game. This over especially. If the batsman is hitting the right shots, he's going for the big ones uh, and he uh, makes it very safe, then it's not a problem. But uh, if the bowler tries to dominate this one, then minus fives can be very, very, very costly. Pros and cons on both sides. When you're trying to make a game like this, 60 runs to win. Just wanted to be sure with the fielding. Shobit with the first ball. Okay. 
and uh, that will be a very 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 confident and a good delivery it's trying to keep that up uh, give it a little bit of height to the ball very 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 close on the back foot again nicely played uh, just a quick single and that will be a minus 5 for which uh, every fielding team wants it in the monster over So, but the, oh, this is again very close. What he's trying to do is he's trying to bowl a very deceiving line and length, keeping it just outside the off stump. And when he's even pitching it uh, on the off stump as an over pitch delivery, he's just maintaining some kind of a height because of which the batsman has not uh, been able to uh, execute their shots properly, as you saw uh, what happened with Sagar Dalvi. If you give a short pitch, look at that, look at that. Uh, this time the ball coming close to the batsman, pitching it outside the off stump and a wonderful show there by Shobit. An ideal uh, monster over that any team would love to have. Uh, he's bowled some fantastic line and length here. And he's done the job for his team. Uh, four overs now, only just 13 runs on the scoreboard. 47 runs more to win of 24 deliveries. This competition is getting exciting. One side you have Zaid, who is one of the finest batsmen. Can he make the difference today? Can he make his win team win today? All that you need is big shots, big shots and only big shots. The only reason that they were pay playing very carefully in that uh, monster over is because they didn't want it to lose any wicket. But I think that restriction is moved now because... Uh, if you're talking about in this particular format of the ground, 47 runs in 24 balls is not a big task. But the way Jupiter 11 is bowling, especially the bowlers, the first four overs started by Keur, and then the bowlers have been bowling very, very, very economically. And that is what is more important when you have a low-scoring game. Especially in the low-scoring game, the bowlers have to be very focused on their line and length. And that's exactly what uh, we can see out here.
Now Nikesh Patani comes to the attack. That will be a big one and uh, that will sail into the crowd for a wonderful sixer. Hitting that black mask. Good strike, low full toss delivery. Zed had to almost stretch himself but what a shot on the uh, front foot. Wanted to go on the onside and a good execution. Nikesh Patani. Brilliant sixer. That will be a no ball and that will uh, give Shoaib the license to go anywhere in the ground. That is a very good delivery. That is a very good delivery. Getting away with that uh, free hit. This is a slower one. Nicely tapped into the gap. Uh, let's see how many runs do they gather. Only a single. Just an extra. Twenty-five runs, uh, playing on an average of five runs per over. This time, it's a missed time shot. Just didn't know where to hit, but uh, the top edge could have been very risky. Escaped, escaped, escaped. Again, uh, GS coming on the ball. Uh, quick single there. And now it's a do or die situation for uh, Safai Stallion. They don't have much runs on the scoreboard. It's always the big hit that is going to save them. Uh, it's a no ball. These are the deliveries that they want more. Zaid wanted to get that advantage of the free hit. Rightly sent back by Shoeb. Wonderful scenes yet out here at the Aether Astro Park. Uh, again, uh, He's bowling some amazing line and land and that would be a direct hit. Deepal goes for that uh, fingers in the air and uh, that will be a very, very good wicket. Zed gone, gone, back to the pavilion.
So the next match is also going to be interesting. We uh, request you to stay tuned. All the matches uh, shown live on TV, courtesy uh, Seven Star Digital, on channel number 99. Of course, uh, you can see all these matches live on YouTube as well. Courtesy uh, Tennis Cricket dot in. They've been covering live uh, matches out here. Of course, uh, Viking Warriors uh, won the toss, uh, selected to uh, field first, have invited Ricky Tigers to bat first. Well, again, I think Ricky Tigers wouldn't be minding uh, batting first because they've got a good batting side, whereas Viking Warriors has been showing some uh, amazing performances in the past. They have been doing really well in this uh, MCS Season 9. So it's going to be a good contest to watch. Good to see uh, Harish Sarvaya after a long time on the back foot. Punched it very nicely. No single there. Well, all stars will be playing today. A couple of matches today here. Good scenes uh, at uh, the 8th Astro Park. End of uh, the sixth over, and now they need more 31 runs of 12 deliveries. That will be an another big wicket. Another big wicket uh, brings uh, Rizwan on strike. Thirty-nine runs on the scoreboard. Now they need every big run, every possible run. This could be a direct uh, throw, but that will be also an overthrow.
चल हो सकता है यार सफायर मारो कितने बॉल है आठ बॉल Another big wicket, Rizwan goes back to the dugout. Preet is the new man in. Just seven deliveries remaining now. That is a big one, uh, but uh, straight on the extra covers region. Quick single there. Show it back on strike. End of the over. It is 42. Need more 18 runs from six balls. Well, that will be a decision that will be reviewed. That will be a free hit. Full toss ball, nicely pulled away. Good advantage taken there. So with that six, it is going to be 50 up as well. More 10 runs to go. In just five deliveries. It's anybody's game from here on. Especially the way... Uh, show has started. Again, trying to hit that big one. Uh, was very close. Nine runs needed of four. Good to see Rishabh Thakkar. And of course, just made Mago. Eight 
in the air for some time, uh, not in the gap exactly, but just a quick single. Eight needed of three. They need a six here. And that will be a big one uh, for a sixer. It's two runs needed more in just two deliveries. What a turnaround in just the last over. Low full toss converted into a big one. And a very, very, very good shot. And a wonderful play by uh, Sapphire Stallions. Show it the man who took them to victory.